And I apologize if I look like a mess, but it's a Saturday morning. And I um, think that you guys don't mind if I don't have makeup on. So thank you for not minding. Um, I... Someone is interrupting my video by hammering something. Whatever. Well, okay, guys, so today I wanted to do a video uh, on my top five favorite cloth pad shops. So I'm kind of doing this um, after being a really big fan of the uh, similar video that was made by Roanna Jameen. And I'll link hers below just since I am kind of copying this concept, even though I'm sure she wasn't the first one to do it. Um, but I saw her video and it helped me out a lot. So I thought that, um, especially for people who are based in um, North America or the US, um, it'd be good just to see what shops are here, um, or that at least ship here, uh, that I've really enjoyed. Um, because I think sometimes it is really difficult to figure out which shops are good for you just based on price and shape and all that fun stuff. So um, these shops um, are not ranked in any particular order. Um, so I'm just going to go ahead and get started. So the first shop that I want to um, recommend is Mother Moon Pads. Um, this was one of the very first makers that I ever purchased from. Um, this one right here is a 12 inch heavy. This was um, in my very first order from her. I bought this because of the topper and no other reason. Um, this was actually the pad that made me want to try her shop. And it's absolutely amazing. Um, Mother Moon does a surged edge, which makes it a little bit different from the vast majority of my stash. Um, so you can see that there. And um, all of her pads have a really kind of straight style with a really subtle flare and then a rounded, a rounded edge. And they're all symmetrical. Um, I think just about every single maker that I purchase from does symmetrical pads, and she's no different. Um, this one is hilarious. I mean, this topper is just absolutely ridiculous. I absolutely love it. I think you can tell that she has a really good sense of humor um, making pads like this. And then here's another one just to show you. Um, these last two are 10-inch pads. Um, this one is a heavy, and this one is a moderate. And her pads are also really thin. That's one of the benefits, too, of a surged edge, is that um, you don't really get some of the, the ridge issues um, that sometimes make a pad show through your um, clothing. Um, with Mother Moon, on top of them being thin to begin with, the edges are like paper. And can you see that? So these are really comfortable. They're really um, just workable in just about any outfit that I've ever worn um, and they are well made and the customer service is absolutely amazing. When um, when I first ordered this one because I was so new to cloth pads I didn't really understand the backing material and she was willing to answer questions even though I'm sure that the questions sounded really silly and like duh to her. She took the time to message back and forth with me on Etsy and I just thought that was fabulous. So good customer service. Mother Moon, love them. Okay, um, again, these are in no particular order, but my second favorite that I'm going to point out to you is Annie Bell's Essentials. Um, this is another Etsy shop um, and this is run by a another just customer focused maker who has some of the highest quality pads that I have ever tried. Um, one of the things that um, I really like about her is that um, Annie Bell's Essentials always uses WinPro as a backing material, and I've just found that this is, is my absolute favorite backer. But then her toppers are also, I mean, look at that. They're beautiful. So she has a really good eye for fabrics that work well on such a small canvas. Um, this one is a cotton top. I actually just got this one about a week ago. Absolutely love it. It's a 10 inch. This is another 10 inch. Um, this one is a minky top. Uh, love it. Um, minky just doesn't tend to work out for me very well because I live in the desert, but I just couldn't help it. I thought that one was adorable. And then this one was the print that convinced me to order from her because I, I don't know what it is, but I'm just obsessed with British culture. I just feel like it's so much more interesting and sophisticated than us, us Americans. Um, so I just thought that this was absolutely adorable. It made me think of um, London Calling, that song by The Clash. So anyways, absolutely love it. So um, again, she's on Etsy. 
and um, her her pads are just put together so well. They're so consistent. The sewing is amazing. Even her second quality pads are probably better than the vast majority of the pads that I have in my stash. I mean, she is just an absolute seamstress and really focused on customer service, and she ships like lightning. Um, she lives 3,000 miles away from me, and I have gotten pads in less than 72 hours before. So, I mean, that's absolutely amazing. So, really, really great shop. Okay, um, the third shop I want to point out, um, these pads look a little different than the ones I've shown so far because um, these are specific to um, postpartum or overnight needs, um, and they are by Eco Alternatives. Um, it's another Etsy shop. I do the vast majority of my shopping on Etsy, um, and these, um, I'm going to show you one more. They're both flannel topped. They're 13 inches, so they're pretty hefty, um, and they are just huge. I mean, look at that. Compared to my Annie Bells, they're massive. Um, but I am a really heavy bleeder, so it's important for my overnight pads that they be big. So I bought these two. Um, I think this was my second order ever of cloth pads because I was really concerned about overnight. And um, I picked the two toppers that I thought were the cutest. And um, these have been some of my absolute favorite pads from day one, and they still remain some of my absolute favorites. And one of the reasons why is that I have never leaked. I bleed so heavy, and these pads are so thin, and I never leak. I mean, it's amazing. Um, there is so much coverage along the gusset of your underwear. Let's see if I can show you. All of that is covered when you're sleeping, or maybe for really heavy postpartum bleeding, um, that you can feel really confident that you're not going to bleed um, the one thing with her shop is that she does, I believe, or at least when I ordered these, um, she makes all of her pads to order. So um, you see a, um, a photo of the topper in the, sh in the style that you're interested in. Um, and then typically, um, I think it's about a two week wait um, before they ship. So these did take just a tiny bit longer to get to me, but they're perfect. They're amazing. The sewing is phenomenal and um, just a really really great shop to work with I definitely will be ordering from them again I just don't need a whole lot of overnights um, but she also does have day pads um, I just haven't bought the day pads um, but I can at least recommend these I think they're absolutely amazing and she has dozens upon dozens of topper options um, almost as varied as Mother Moon and I think Mother Moon probably has the biggest fabric um, collection that I've ever seen Okay, so that's um, three. So now moving on to my fourth maker, Novel Red. Um, I have done a review on them. Well, I don't know them. I mean, I think it's just one person, but um, I hate to mention the names of makers just in case they don't want their names out there. I'm pretty sure that everyone knows who the maker is at Novel Red, but just in case. Um, these are her crushed velvet pads and um, they are phenomenally fantastic and amazing and wonderful and my favorites. <laughs> um, so this is the flared style um, that she does and this is um, Jabberwocky which is um, a dark green uh, crushed velvet topper and then this one is the straight style so you can see it's quite different in shape um, and rather narrow as well. Um, and this one is in Mad Hatter, which is a really deep, gorgeous pinky purple. And um, you can tell the difference in these styles. Let's see if I can see how much the, um, the green shows through from behind. So really, whether you want a narrow pad or you need something with a lot more coverage and a lot more of a pronounced flare, you can find something that will work for you at Novel Red. They have a huge variety of lengths and absorbency options. Um, they use really high quality WinPro as a backer. Their cores are really thin and the sewing is phenomenal. I mean, I think all of the um, makers that I'm highlighting today have amazing sewing, but these just feel like perfect. Um, and for somebody who lives in a really warm climate, um, crushed velvet is an amazing 
topper fabric and she has a really wide variety of color options um, because crushed velvet is kind of a newer thing and um, a lot of shops don't really have a big amount of colors. She has so many and they're all gorgeous and I'm probably eventually going to have every color. Um, but yeah, Novel Red, absolutely amazing and probably my best ever customer service experience. And she just actually won um, in October. No, not October. What am I talking about? It's not even October. In August, she won the customer service award from Christie's List, which is a huge group on Facebook. I'll link them below. If you're not a part of Christie's List, you should be. So um, definitely Novel Red, highly recommended. And then my last shop um, that I want to highlight today is um, maybe a, a newer, slightly lesser known shop, but an absolutely amazing maker, Cuddle Blossom Cloth. So, um, Cuddle Blossom is a maker that um, I first saw on Instagram. And um, she has a lot of really fun tutorials on YouTube as well. I love her YouTube channel. Um, and she... While her fabric options maybe aren't as varied as like a Mother Moon pads or um, Eco Alternatives, her fabrics are so much more unique. Um, she has fabrics that I don't think I've seen in any other shop. And this, um, these two pads are from the same fabric. They're just cut in different, um, in different spots on the pattern. I mean, look at them. Isn't that amazing? So her, um, her pads are really, really unique. And I don't see a whole lot of people coming up with pads that look like this. Um, the sewing is spot on. She marks her absorbencies with this cute little ribbon. She's actually the only maker in my stash who does the ribbon thing. And I actually kind of like it. I think it's really awesome. I think all of the pads that I have from her are the same absorbency. But I just think that that's cute. Um, and customer service again is spot on she ships really really quickly she's a really pleasant person to work with um and i think i think that that's why these five makers are my favorites because each and every one of them have done something to make me feel like i wasn't just a number and i wasn't just an order that i was an actual person and they wanted to make sure that my experience was positive so um katie at cuddle blossom was definitely one of those people. I'm gonna link both her shop and her YouTube channel um, down below because if you are a new sewer um, or seamstress or whatever you wanna call it, um, she does a lot of really great tutorials. Um, one of my favorites of hers is a wet bag tutorial that she does. Um, I definitely think you should check her out. Um, she also has a video where she talks about her process in making patterns and how she arrived at, at this style and this shape. Um, so I definitely think that she's a really great resource, if nothing else, but her pads are absolutely amazing. Well, um, have a good weekend. Um, here in the U.S., we're having a long weekend, or at least the majority of us are. So um, I'll probably be making a couple more videos this weekend, but I hope you guys enjoyed this one. And um, let me know in the comments if you have um, a different top five. Um, maybe you could recommend shops that I haven't tried out before. So I will talk to you guys soon, and have a great weekend.